What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to talk to you guys about how to heal uh, an infected hangnail. So I've been having a lot of fun doing my nails lately but one of my nails started hurting and it came to my attention that it was indeed infected. So I'm going to talk to you about how to know if your hangnail is infected. So you'll know if your hangnail is infected because it will be sensitive to the touch, it will be swollen, and it will also be hot to the touch. It's important to heal your hangnail fast because if not, bacteria can enter your body and it can lead to the flu. So number one, once you notice that you do have an infected hangnail, you're going to be able to tell because it's going to look something like this. It's going to be red and it's going to be swollen and it's going to hurt. So number one, what you're going to have to do is get some cuticle nippers and nip that hanging nail off of there. You want to get any pressure that is applying to the hangnail off of there. So get you some cuticle nippers and make sure you get some sharp ones like these ones that I have in this picture here. You can buy them from um, any nail store. I got some good ones from TJ Maxx. Actually, they were only $5. So after you do that, you do want to move, remove any nail enhancement that you have and also remove nail polish as well. Keep the hangnail area very clean with some antibacterial soap. You want to make sure you keep this area very clean because if any bacteria gets in there that can start the infection all over again um something good is also hydrogen peroxide this will also help to remove any bacteria just you know if you're feeling that it's hurting and you really want it to get clean put some hydrogen peroxide on the hangnail so after you clip your hangnail you do and wash it and dry it put some shea butter on the hangnail so you can keep it nice and moisturized and this next ingredient is something that really, really helps heal minds really fast, and that is geranium oil. And as you can see, geranium oil has a lot of benefits, including being antibacterial, and it removes fungus, and it just is something that really helps to heal any open wounds. And also something that's another favorite of mine is tea tree oil. I use tea tree oil for the same thing, but I didn't have any tea tree oil. I had geranium oil. So I put geranium oil on my hangnail and it worked amazing. <clears throat> then you want to go ahead and get a band-aid. If you're going to be outside of the house, get a band-aid to keep the um keep any dirty air or any bacteria outside of your house from getting on your open wound so it can heal and before you know it your hangnail will be gone and you'll be able to enjoy fresh sets of nails you'll be able to put nail polish back on your hands and you'll be so happy because hangnails can suck if you let them just go unattended to so i do hope this video helped you guys and let me know if you have a hangnail because i do want you to try this method because it did work for me um mine's is healing in under a week and the healing process is going absolutely amazing for me i can't wait till it's all healed so i can go ahead and put some more nails on my hands and get some nail videos out for you guys so thanks for watching and give this video a like and subscribe to my channel and you guys have a great day. Bye.